Hello guys, welcome to another short tutorial on Angular. In this video, I am going to show you how we can add header and footer that is fixed one in our Angular application. In many of the website or application you might have seen, there will be a header which uh, will consist of some logo or any title and which will be fixed at the top and similarly there will be a footer which will consist of some of the details about the company like it might be copyright of the company or any other quick links uh, to the sites uh, web pages or anything uh, which will be used as a footer so and that will also be a fixed one the fixed headers and footers are very useful when you have lot of content in your website and uh, these fixed uh, headers and footer gives flexibles to the user to navigate to the site's other contents or they can see the content like header easily without any scrolling. So let's see how we can make that one in our Angular application. For that one let me create a separate component first. Now I have a component created for our Angular header and footer. Currently this have default content that is header footer works. So let me copy this selector here and paste it into main component that is app.component.html file. Now this project have only this app header and footer. Let me run this project so that before we adding header or footer we can see how the project looks like. You can see we have only simple text that is header hyphen footer works which is the default content which is added into our HTML page. So let's add header and footer for this project. For that one let me create one division first and name that one as header. As I said usually the web pages will have a logo and some titles in the header. So let me add one span here. Within this one I can add image. Currently I have one image in asset that is logo.png. So I can copy and add this one as a logo for our project. So for this one I will add the path as assets by logo.png and I will give a width of 20 pixels for this image. Let me add another span which will have a content or title of this project. So that will be the header for our project. And similarly, let me add a footer for this project. One example of the footer is it will have a content of copyright. Let me add a copyright. To add the copyright symbol in HTML, we need to have and copy. So there is a symbol we need to use and let me add copyright for this site. For this example, I have a simple content here. So as soon as I type and save this file, it will recompile so that we can go to browser and you can observe simple content that is logo and footer has been added now. And I don't need this, the default content which is generated by the Angular project. So let us add some content in between this one so that we can see the difference how it will look or how header and footers will fit into our project. So before that one let me add a class or name for our footer that is footer. Then I will add some dummy content within the division which will be our main content of the project. For this example, I am going to add a simple content or dummy content within this project. As you can see here, I have added a dummy content here. So let me save this project. It auto compiles and if I go back to a browser, you can see there is a header at the top and the footer which is at the bottom. And you can observe that there is a lot of scrolling for this project. It would be good if this header fits at the top always and the footer which should stick to the bottom always so that it will be easy to the users to navigate to other links or see this information. To do that one you can use simple CSS styles by applying those it will stick to the top and bottom. So let's see how we can do that one. So I have copied the header now to define the styles for header and footer. 
there is a CSS style called position which will help us to fix the element any division or any image or any text at the top or bottom or the right or left side in our web page so in this example for this header I want to fix or position this one at the top so that I can make this one as position fixed and I need to define as I want to uh, fix this one at the top I can make this one as top as 0 percentage similarly for the footer as I want to fix or show this one at the bottom always define the position as fix and define bottom as 0 percentage save this file and go back to browser and you can observe that e-learning logo that's being displaying at the top always and it's overlapping the text Similarly, footer is also showing at the bottom always. So let's have some of the properties for header and footer so that it will be clearly visible to us. I have added one background color and I will add some padding to the text. And I will make this header 100% to the browser so that it will occupy entire page of the website. And the color of the content will be white. Similarly for the footer, I will add background color, gray color and I will align the text to the center and the padding of 10 pixel and this one also should be visible 100% of the, that's why I will define width as 100% for this one and the color of the text should be white. So let me save this one, Angular project auto compiles and if you go back to the browser you can observe our header which is showing at the top and you can observe that it always fits or shown at the top and similarly footer which is showing at the bottom always. So whatever the content we add within our page it won't affect our header and footer and whatever the header and footer we have added it will be shown always at the top and the bottom this is very useful in real-time applications where we'll build the web applications or websites in this example I have added only logo and title and a copyright information in our header and footer you can add images or any content or any hyperlinks to other pages of your website so that by like that we can make use of these headers and footers in our web sites or applications thanks guys for watching this video if you like this video please click on like button share it to others and subscribe to my channel